I want to talk briefly about uh, principles of divine impartations. Principles of, principles of divine impartations. Yes. Je vais parler des principes des impartations divines. Because when I come to a conference like this, Parce que quand je, à une among pareil, many other things, parmi choses, I am coming for impartations. Je une impartation. Impartations are key. I've seen them work in my life ces via dans ma vie, the servant of God par le to de us Dieu. as a ministry. Et un we are here when they're talking of the building structures. We are here much indebted to, to Bishop Doug. Nous sommes vraiment endettés à Bishop Doug. When we talk of church growth Quand and raising sons, croissance de l'église, again, encore. when we talk of music, Quand on again, parle de musique, the same encore. man, everything that we have copied from him seems to work for us. Tout ce que nous I think a bit better than others, but we, it seems to work. Tout yes. ce que nous copions mm. de lui, ça marche pour nous. Romans 1 verse 11 will read, for I long to see you that I may impart to you some spiritual gift so that you may be established. Je, so you see, j'ai le désir de vous voir pour vous transmettre quelques dons de grâce. That impartations bring that establishment that we so need. Je vois que cette impartation, c'est l'établissement que nous the voyons. The second scripture is Deuteronomy 34 verse 9. Deuteronome 24, verset 9. Now Joshua, the son of Nun, was full of the spirit of wisdom. Josué, for, for Moses had laid his hands on him. Moïse avait posé ses mains sur lui. So the children of Israel hearkened or heeded him Les... and did as the Lord commanded. Les enfants d'Israël lui obéirent et se conformèrent aux ordres que l'Éternel avait donné à Moïse. I think one of the ways to live beyond your limitations Une manière de vivre um, au-delà de vos limites is to receive impartations. Et de recevoir l'impartation. And to receive impartations you must create a gradient. Et pour recevoir l'impartation vous devez Water recevoir does not flow on the level surface. Une colline. L'eau ne coule pas sur une surface plate. Water needs a gradient. L'eau a besoin d'un angle. Bishop Oliver, thank you for the message, by the way. I'm Bishop nervous Oliver, here as well, merci. so I forgot about your message. Water flows Down. when there's a gradient. L'eau coule quand il y a une pente. So when you find great men like these, you actually create a gradient so that there will be a flow of the anointing to you. Say amen. So, if you don't create a gradient, it's very difficult to receive. You may be older than that person or think you are wiser than that person. If you don't create a gradient, you stop receiving. Si vous n'avez pas cet angle, vous ne pouvez pas recevoir. And therefore, creating a gradient takes a lot of humility upon our lives, all of us. Cela demande beaucoup d'humilité. So that we may receive. Pour que nous puissions recevoir. That way, we go beyond our limitations. C'est comme ça qu'on dépasse nos limites. Because we are born with many limitations. Parce que nous sommes nés avec beaucoup limitations de limites. Limitations in mind. Des limitations. L- limitations in the spirit. Nos pensées dans notre esprit. Limitations in the natural. Et des limites aussi naturellement. So what is impartation? Just Qu'est-ce give you a few definitions. Qu'est-ce que c'est l'impartation? Impartation is transference of divine virtues. C'est un transfert de, de vertus divines. It is also transference of divine deposits. C'est aussi un transfert de dépôts divins. I am here for divine deposits and transfers. Je suis ici pour des dépôts et des transferts divins. It is divin. also transference of divine graces, C'est grace of God that comes. C'est aussi un transfert de grâce divine. divine. There are five sources of impartation. Il y a cinq sources de l'impartation. But I want, I want to deal with one, one piece so that, that I catch my time. Je vais parler d'une seule. The first, first one, one is through, through divine, divine encounters. encounters. The second one is through father-son relationship. 
If you have no one to look to that you call a father, you will find that you'll be limited in your life. Si vous n'avez personne à qui vous pouvez appeler, qui, que vous so pouvez appeler père, vous serez limité. Need fathers Nous avons besoin des pères in the kingdom of God dans le royaume de that Dieu. have gone ahead of us qui sont allés devant that nous, then can impart something in our lives. Nous d'une manière ou d'une also, a prophetic word brings impartation. Donc, une parole prophétique aussi apporte une impartation. When a prophetic word is released, it changes your life. Quand une parole prophétique est relâchée, ça Last change la vie. Year, on a Friday, Bishop ended prophesying a lot on different people. L'année passée, le vendredi, Bishop a I prophétisé sur beaucoup de personnes. There were lot of at Et that je crois time. qu'il y avait eu beaucoup d'impartations ce jour-là. I want to focus on number one, keys je, to divine encounters. Divine je, encounters. je vais me focaliser sur les, les rencontres Here divines. Here is the first key to divine encounters. Les rencontres divines. Isolation and separation. L'isolation et la If séparation. If God has to encounter you, He isolates you. Si Dieu veut vous rencontrer, il vous isole. He takes you away from familiar ground. Il vous éloigne de, d'un terrain familier. He takes you away from your common friends. Il vous euh, sépare so de vos amis. So that he can deal with you alone. Pour que il puisse vous parler seul. God has never dealt with people en masse. Dieu n'a jamais traité avec des gens en masse. He can take you to Timbuktu or take you elsewhere or take you to Zimbabwe just to deal with you. Il peut vous éloigner jusqu'à Timbuktu ou If you are one that is always among people and never time alone with him, you will find it very difficult to be encountered by si God. Si vous êtes quelqu'un qui n'est jamais seul, il sera difficile pour Dieu de and vous parler. Therefore, God is a specialist in isolating people. Donc Dieu est spécialiste dans l'isolation. I'm here to gens. tell you if you feel isolated today, you know that there is something that is about to happen in your life in the name of Jesus Quelque Christ. Chose est sur le point de vous arriver dans votre He vie, has votre a vie. way of moving friends away from you. Il a une manière d'éloigner des amis Those de that vous. you want to lean on, he takes them away. Ceux sur lequel vous voulez vous, Those vous pencher, that you want to trust pas. in, he moves them deliberately so that you can look to him. Ceux en, en qui vous voulez vous confier, il I les enlève pour que vous le regardiez. I see a character called Jacob in the Bible. Je regarde à quelqu'un qui s'appelait Jacob dans la Bible. I want to read Genesis 32, verse 24 to 28. It says, then Jacob was left alone. Jacob hey, yeah. demeura seul. Alone, alone, seul. alone, alone. Seul. When you are left alone, you have no one to lean on. Quand vous êtes seul, vous n'avez personne sur qui vous sur qui dépendre. Jacob was coming back from Haran after 20 years. Jacob revenait après 20 ans. He had met his uncle Laban. They had conned each other with uncle Laban. Il a rencontré son oncle Laban. But God here, he made sure that he was left alone. Mais Dieu ici, il a fait de sorte qu'il soit seul. When you are left alone, God deals with you Quand vous êtes in seul, a unique way, in Dieu, a special way. Dieu peut parler avec I vous. pray that after this conference, you'll be left alone. Je prie qu'après cette that conférence, when you vous are alone, seul. You try to look to your friends, they are not around. You are first to look up instead of sideways. Quand vous and he begins to deal with you when you are là, alone. Vous allez, vous serez Please lift up your hands and say, Isolate me, Lord. Lift up your hands and say, Isolate me, Lord. Listen to verse 25. He says, Now when he saw that he did not prevail against him, he touched the socket of his hip. And the second of Jacob, Jacob's hip was out of joint as he wrestled with him. Merci And he sense. said, verse 26, 26, let me go for the day breaks. But he said, that is Jacob, I will not let you go until you bless me. If he had friends, they would have said, hey, just give up. But because he was alone, alone, il était seul. Alone. Il était seul. You find Jacob's name being changed from Jacob, a corn artist, a supplanter, a cheat, a kubuzela in Zulu, and God began to deal with him because he was left alone. Jacob était transformé d'un bandit, un, un... The second key to divine encounters seul. is focus. When you focus. 
Vous devez focus. être focalisé. When you look at a thing and it's a vision, you refuse to look sideways, but you are focus concerning that Quand vous refusez de regarder à gauche à droite et vous êtes focalisé sur lui. Elijah one day said in 1 Kings 18:21. And Elijah came to all the people and said, "How long will you falter between two opinions?" How long? Quand clocherez-vous de deux côtés? If the Lord is God, follow him. Si l'Éternel est Dieu, allez après lui. If Baal, then follow Baal. Si c'est Baal, allez so, après lui. In serving God, if we are to get the maximum impact, it is this thing called focus. Si Dieu doit avoir un impact, c'est cette are, chose qui s'appelle We le are focus. amazed at the level of focus with Bishop Doug. Nous sommes Each time you à think you, focus you have avec seen Dan. this side of him, you see another side. Quand vous voyez un côté de lui, so, vous verrez un autre côté. It keeps on making us wanting to come over and over again. Yesterday, today, I saw the structures that side. Donc, I ça nous they donne envie de venir encore et encore parce que the tout change. is focused on his vision. L'homme est focalisé I sur sa pray vision. that you and I will be focused in our vision Je in the name of Jesus Christ. So focus vision becomes key number two. Le focus devient le, la clé key numéro number deux. three is sacrifice. Et la clé, troisième clé, c'est le sacrifice. If you can't sacrifice when God has called you, si vous ne pouvez pas faire des sacrifices quand Dieu vous appelle, nothing ever happens in your life. Rien ne va marcher dans votre vie. The other meaning of a call is literally sacrifice. Une autre, dé, une autre définition de l'appel, c'est le sacrifice. God will require you to sacrifice a time Dieu you're thinking. Demande que nous sacrifions. Lord, are you killing me? What is this? Sacrifice becomes key. Le sacrifice devient la guérison. David sacrificed. David a fait des sacrifices. David numbered the armies of God one time. He numbered the armies of God one time. Il a numéroté l'armée de Dieu une fois. And God was displeased with that. Et Dieu n'était pas content du he tout. He was not happy. Il n'était pas du tout content. Because he was trying to lean on his might. Parce qu'il était and God began to give him punishment for Et that. Dieu voulait le punir pour he cela. He chose one of the three punishments. Il a choisi un, une, he euh, said, une I would rather fall into the hands of the living God than in the hands of man. Il a dit, je préfère tomber dans les mains so, de Dieu que dans les mains des hommes. So, when he selected that punishment, et quand il a choisi cette punition, look what happened when God began to punish him. Look regardez, at the sacrifice. Regardez ce qui s'est passé. First Chronicles 21, verse 22 to 26. Then David said to Onan, Grant me the place of the threshing floor, that I may build an altar unto thee for the Lord. You shall grant it to me at the full price, that the plague may be withdrawn from the people. And Onan, looking at the king, thought he will discount the king and give him at a lesser value or free of charge. And Onan said to David, Take it yourself. Let my lord the king do what is good in his eyes. Look, I also give you the oxen for burnt offerings, the threshing floor implements for wood, and the wheat for the grain offering. I give it all free of charge. Oh, watch what David says in verse 24 now. Verse 24. Then King David said to Onan, no. Say no with me. Did no. But I will surely buy it for the full price. Je vais l'acheter contre For I will not take what is yours for the Lord, nor offer burnt offerings with that which costs me nothing. Je ne présenterai point à l'Éternel ce qui est à toi. People are looking for discounts point. everywhere. And they make a mistake that you can look for discounts from God. Vous ne pouvez God pas chercher requires à la that we pay Dieu. the full price as Dieu. we serve him. At times, the full price differs complet. among each one of us. Full price. I'm le sorry, I'm messing complet. up. Yeah. Full price. Le prix au complet. And God desires that we pay the full price. Et Dieu veut que nous payons le prix David, total. the Bible says, paid the full price. Et David a payé And that prix. day, the plague ceased. Et la plague Point a cessé. Point number four. Prayer and fasting. Numéro 4, la prière. There is nothing that moves us closer to God 
than prayer and fasting. Il n'y a rien qui ne rapproche de Dieu plus que God la prière does et not le change, so it doesn't change because we are praying and fasting. Dieu ne change pas et But il ne change we pas change parce que nous to hear prions. God better when we pray and Mais fast. Mais nous changeons quand nous prions et nous I jeûnons. remember Daniel chapter 10, the prayer of Daniel. Le the three week prayer of Daniel. Daniel, Daniel prayed. No answer for three weeks. Daniel a prié, But pas de réponse when the fâche. answer finally came after 21 days, Mais quand la est venue après 21 the jours, angel Gabriel said, from the first day you set your heart to pray, a dit, de, dès le premier jour I que tu as commencé la you. Prière, entendu. An answer was dispatched. Et une a été But envoyée. the prince of Persia withheld him. Mais le prince de Perse a retenu. And then he went back to get reinforcement, being Michael, And the answer came in after 21 days. Et il est allé chercher le renforcement But the man had been ange. praying and fasting. Mais il a prié, il a jeûné. Many Christians don't like praying and fasting. Beaucoup de personnes n'aiment pas jeûner et prier. But praying and fasting is the key to divine encounters. Mais prier et jeûner c'est la clé When pour les rencontres divines. When we pray and fast, divin. somehow we cause God to come into our situation. Quand vous priez, vous jeûnez, vous vous obligez Dieu de situation. venir dans notre situation. Number five. Numéro 5. Is perseverance. Et la persévérance. This is the last one. Perseverance. La persévérance. When you refuse to give up. Quand vous refusez d'abandonner. In ministry there are many occasions. Dans le ministère il y a plein d'occasions. That we give up. Qui vous demande d'abandonner. The call itself at times can be so difficult. So difficult the call. The le, call of God can be so difficult. difficile. That it would demand at times and pressurize you to want to give up. Et vous êtes sous pression parfois de d'abandonner. But if we persevere, mais si nous persévérons, if we refuse to give up, si nous refusons d'abandonner, if we refuse to surrender, si nous refusons de d'abandonner, somehow at the end of the day, d'une manière ou d'une autre, God à la fin, comes through for us Dieu in a special way, in the name of Jesus Christ. D'une manière spéciale dans le These nom de Jésus. These are keys that will help us. Voici les clés qui vont nous aider. In the days that lie ahead. Dans les jours Please qui sont stand with me. I've only 10 minutes. I need to stop. Est-ce que vous pouvez vous